Hello everybody and welcome to The Sims 3. I've not got a clue what I'm doing on this game. I kind of posted on Twitter earlier saying uh, I'm feeling a bit spontaneous and uh, a bit a bit elegant and a bit saucy. And <laughs> I don't know, I kind of said, what would you guys like to see on your Sunday evening? Uh, and a lot of you said uh, Minecraft and stuff like that, but I do Minecraft all the time. So... I was just thinking I might as well give The Sims 3 a go, so I don't know what this is going to turn into. It might turn into a Let's Play, I'm not really sure. We're just going to see how it goes. I haven't played this game in ages. I think the last time I played this was on the Xbox original or 360, I can't remember. Uh, I think it was called Busting Out, Sims Busting Out. Uh, but we're going to give it a go on this, it should be pretty awesome. I'm going to create a Sim, I'm going to call it something. Uh, but we're going to do it, let's do this. Create a Sim. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> oh my god. So much nostalgia for this game. I believe The Sims 4 is actually coming out at the end of the year. So, spoiler alert, I did have plans um, to do a Let's Play on that. But, uh, I was so excited to play this game, so we're going to give it a go now. So, let's do this. Uh, we don't want to be a female. I'm basically going to create a character around myself. So, would you like a brief lesson? No, I, I got this in the bag, so... There's a woman here. I don't want to be a woman. I want to be a male. And I actually want to be a uh, squidoodle. So, does that look like me? No, it doesn't really. Does it? Wee! Wee! <laughs> We're going to go back in time. No. Okay, so what should we call him? Let's call him... Um, not really sure what we should call him. I don't really have a clue. How about... Um, okay, what we'll do is we'll create a character. We're going to have him as a toddler. Right? And if this does somewhat turn into a Let's Play, then we can basically, like, go through the stages of his life. So it'll be, like, the guy's character from the toddler till uh, an old man and then until he passes away, sad face. So I suppose we could go on a journey. Uh, us, me and you could go on a journey uh, through this young young man's life. Not really sure what we're going to call him. Whee! <laughs> I like how they just spit on the floor. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. All right, let's just let's just create a. Let's, I'm gonna create like a random character, okay? And then what we'll do is we'll name him whatever he looks like, okay? So he's gonna be. I like everything about that so far. I'll come back to his name and stuff like that. So what have we got here? I need 707. Uh, yeah, 775 sim points to the. Top, top of the tots hairstyle and headwear. What is this? Should we have a bald baby? Um, no. Let's have a. That's, he's got like an afro there. What are these sim points? How do I get sim points? I don't even know. This is weird. This has changed so much. Um. Okay, we're gonna go for the long hair, and we're gonna go. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, we're gonna go brown hair. Uh, what's this? Can we give him a cap? Ah, oh, we can give him a little cap. Right, let's give him something like that then. That'd be pretty cool. And then we can also change his eyebrows, I believe. Um, yeah, that'll do. Should we give him... We'll match the hair colour. That's what we'll do. Uh, I think that looks about right. Um, what's all these things? We've got loads of different colours. Why is his eyebrows... Oh, there we go. That's the colour. Match the hair root colour. Has he got black hair? No, we're gonna go for we we'll go for that. Um, we give him medium <laughs> eyelashes length. We don't want to make him look too feminine. Feminine, minimum, minimum. Min, min. uh, what else are we gonna do? Oh, this is like eyes and ears and stuff. Okay. Oh God. The thing is, I don't know how, what he's gonna grow up looking like because you don't really know. Like he'll change face like a million. Has he got like a little mole on his face? He's got like a little. He's got like a little mole on his face. He's got a Marilyn Monroe on his face. How about something that looks like... Woo! Uh, that. That looks perfect. Okay. Uh, wow. I've got like how much stuff you can actually do in The Sims. That looks fine. I'm just going to uh, blast through this because I could literally uh, be here just for hours just customizing his face. There we go. That'll do. His mouth's all right. Uh, beauty marks. We're going to leave his beauty marks because they're beautiful. Uh, anything else we can give him? <laughs> we can give him a tiger face. <laughs> oh dear. Well, I'm not going to do that. We want to give you a good start in life, so we'll um, we'll take away your makeup. How do we? How do we? Is that done? There we go. It's, the, the makeup has been successfully removed. 
Can I change his eye colour? The blue eyes are alright. Um, yeah, that'll do. Okay, so what do we got here? Let's go for... <laughs> He's gonna walk around butt naked every day. <laughs> we're gonna give him... We're gonna give him a blue t-shirt. Uh, can we give him anything else? Oh, we can choose like his formal outfit and stuff. Uh, bottoms, we'll give him some... Bright red jogging bottoms, some some decent swag. This is this is gym jams. We're gonna give him, we're gonna give him them. He looks amazing. Uh, shoes. Oh, what do we do? With shoes. We should do some socks. He's gonna walk around in socks all day like a boss. Accessories. Do you give toddlers accessories? What is these things? What do they? What do you do? What? What? I'm gonna I'm gonna take that off. I don't really know what they do. Formal. Can we swag him out? Oh, it's the same thing. I think I've just done the same thing over and over again. Sleepy wear. Uh, sleepy wear can be... I don't even have a clue. <laughs> God. That's his sleepy wear, everyone. He is swag. He's, he's keeping his hat on, though, because he's cool. I wonder if he'll grow up with that hat. That'd be awesome. Uh, personality. Okay, we need to name him first. We're going to call him... Uh... I tell you what, I'm gonna call him a name after myself. So we'll call it call, call him. We'll call him Boris Trotter. Let's call him Sir. Sir Fancy. Oh, we'll just do Sir Boris Trotter. There we go. He is now a Sir Boris Trotter. His personality. What are these things? Add add a trait. Okay. Oh, we can do all this. Right, let's have a th look. Let's get him. Let's get him friendly. Friendly is a good trait to have. I want friendly. Anything else? Is that the only trait I can give him? Um, I don't have any current traits. What do I need to do here? I haven't played this game for ages. Okay, I need to add it up there. So he's got a friendly trait. He's also. Um, we don't really want a slob. A light sleeper. A heavy sleeper. Insane. Insane. Should we make him insane? <laughs> I'm making him insane. It's amazing. So now he is he's friendly, but yet insane. He's like, you walk up to him, and he'll be like, hey, nice to meet you. And then you'll turn around for a second, and he'll be like, climbing a tree, and like, hugging a post box. That's the kind of guy that Sir Boris Trotter is. Uh, personalities, food. He loves pancakes, Boris Trotter. He also likes pop. That needs to change. Where's rap? He's got rap. Let's give him Latin. He's, he's, so Boris Trotter is a friendly, friendly psycho guy that loves some pancakes and Latin music. His favourite colour is aqua. Oh, look at all this food we can try. Um, I kind of like pancakes. I'm going to go with pancakes. What is this thing here? Adjust pitch? Can he speak? How am I supposed to tell what a baby sounds like? <laughs> right, let's just give him... Oh god, that's low. And high is gonna be like, run, 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 run. Okay, we're gonna go. So, Fancy Boris Trotter is medium pitch. He's not a squeaker, but he's not Barry White. So, we're gonna go bang in the middle. Uh, his sign is Aqua, because I wanna have it Aqua. And then. Is that it? Is that it? I don't wanna randomize it. I think I'm done. I think I am done. We're done and dusted, guys. We're pretty much ready to go. We're done. Your family needs at least one young adult. Oh, no. What? Um. Okay. So, we're going to have to make someone else then. Actually, what, okay. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to make him a young adult. Then, at least we can get the show on the road. So, let's make him a teen, a young adult. Here we go. So, fancy body's trying. <laughs> Whoa. What? No. Come on. Where's my character gone? We're going to have to go to a child again. Yeah, there he is. What happened to him when he grew up? He got... Yep, sir. Why? Where's your hair gone? Why? What? 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 Wait. All right, let's just go with it. This is Boris Trotter now. He's grown up. He's... He's... I don't know what he is. He's a cool guy. He's... <laughs> let's just go with this. I'm going to press accept. Accept. Sashdo. Sashdo. Here we go, friendly, but yeah, insane. So fancy Boris Trotter, uh, choose something for Boris Trotter to strive for over the course of his life. Uh, lifetime wish is a Rion re surgeon, really? I don't really think that he's good at that. Leader of the three free world. 
jack of all trades, become a creature robot crossbreeder, star news anchor, yeah, or become a creature robot crossbreeder. I'm going to go for star actor. Uh, I think this is going to be, wait, what does this entail? Uh, let's just go for a <laughs> let's go for a news anchor. I think this would be pretty good for Sir Fancy Boris Trotter. He is our oh, leader of the world. Is, is is I don't think he'd be a good politician, judging by him. Could be funny though. Let's go for surgeon. Let's do this. It could be. It could. This could work out. There we go. Sir Fancy Boris Trotter. <laughs> we got this in the bag, guys. Here we are. Family portrait. I'm on my own. I want to be a surgeon. And um, this is going to be absolutely amazing. Right, see, so we are. We are got to choose a place to live. Now choose a lot in the town where you'd like to move in this household. So, here is lovely Squid City. Squitty. Here's lovely Squitty. <laughs> we have 16,000 Somalians at our fingertips. We also have the ability to move. Okay, okay we can rotate and then we can move... Uh, parts of Sim Squid City. So here you can see, I believe, things that we, we can live. Where can we live? So we can live these four properties here. But there's nothing else around that we can actually move into at the moment. So we've got to make our choice uh, from these four lovely properties here. I kind of like this one. It's got its own private lake. It's 15 grand. We are going to be on a tight budget. This one's only 10, so we'd have we'd have room to buy stuff. Uh, I'm just gonna go for this one. Now choose a lot uh, in the town where you'd like to move. Okay, I got this in the bag, guys. We're gonna move into a household. We're gonna move in. Here we go. Let's select him, and we are in. Okay, Mosquito Cove. Imagine your own footbridge leading into your like new home. This small house with big characters situated on a water-rich real estate and includes an almost screen in porch. What is this? I'm going to buy it. We've done it. Let's play. That looks great. Feel free to continue looking at different lots or start playing right now. We're going to go in, guys. We bought our first house. It's got its own private lake. This is amazing. We are going straight into this game. Full throttle. Sir Fancy Boris Trotter is on the property ladder. I don't know where he got his money from, but we don't need to worry about that. So let's have a look at this new house. I'm excited. Hello, Sir Fancy Boris Trotter. Where are you going? He's going into his new house, guys. Look at this. we got a lake and everything. This is amazing. Okay. Here we go, Sir Fancy Boris Trotter. Your new house awaits you. Let's take all the walls down on the house. Here we go. We're going to go inside. Who's this? Who's coming to our door? It's a, it's a lady. We've got two. We've got a paper already. Uh, okay, let's see where this guy is. What's it? Is this sitting on the bathtub? What are you sitting on the bathtub for? <laughs> is, this, is this your new couch? He actually... Wow, look at that decor. What is it? I'm, I'm really terrible at these controls. <laughs> what is it? What's it made out of? Is this like sandstone? He's just staring into the sink. Uh, he needs a toilet, apparently. Let's build him a toilet. How do we get into this mode? I should have really... Um... Buy mode. Here we go. So, he needs some kind of sofa. So, what we can do is we can go downstairs, I believe. There we go. And then we have to buy him a sofa because he's sitting on the bathtub at the moment. This house is really, really, really rubbish. It's very grotty. Lovely wooden house. Um, okay, let's do this. So, kitchen, bedroom, living room. Sofas and love seats. We're going to go for... How much money have we got to spend? 1,200 simoleons. Let's go for... Wow, this music is crazy loud. Um, let's go for... I don't want to spend all my money on a sofa. Let's just go for Le Matchmaker. Uh, no, it's not. That's horrible. Let's go for this one. A nice brown couch. How do we... Can we... Can we... Can we... Can we tilt it? Can we... Oh, look at that. Like a boss. We've got a sofa for him. Let's see if he likes it. Uh, live mode. Let's go back into this. Let's see how he feels about this one. What's he doing at the moment? Where is he? What's he? Stop sitting on the bathtub, mate. Come on, I've just bought you a brand new sofa. There he is. He's going down. He's seen the sofa. He's rocking and rolling. Go on, mate. You can do this. He's seen the sofa. He's, he's going for it. Let's, let's see how he feels about this sofa. He's looking around. He's like, ooh, it's a nice sofa, this. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it loves it. Stone. Many what? Botards. What do you mean? Stone. It's a nice sofa. Try it. Deep muscle hug. It, Sir Fancy Boy Strutter. I told you he was friendly. He was like, yeah. And then he's like, yeah. Can you just sit down? Come on, stop talking to yourself. He's literally just making himself laugh. He's picking his ear now. Come on. Come on, Boris. Get on the sofa, please, Mr. Sir. We really need to fancy you up. You need some kind of new outfits. There you go. Do you like it? Do you like it? Look at, look at that face. <laughs> that face. Oh, my God. What's he doing now? Where's he... Where are you going? Where's he going? What's he doing? He's looking out of the window. He doesn't... Does he not like his sofa? I just... I bought him a sofa. What does this thing says he needs to do? Learn logic skills? God, he's... He wants to learn a lot. I just bought him a sofa for, like, 300 simoleons. He's sat on it once, and that is it. Right, we're going to have to get you a job, my friend. Otherwise, there's going to be bills racking up. Let's look in the paper. Find the job. Get off your bottom and find a job, Boris. Come on. Sort yourself out. He's sitting down. He's having a good read. Has he seen anything yet? A anything? Oh, what's this? A kitchen scullion. Uh, long nights of professional food preparation could be in store for Sir Boris. <laughs> I love that. The best cooks have the right attitude. A strong relationship with the kitchen staff and a firm knowledge of cooking. Yeah, should we? Should we? I mean, it's kind of not... It's kind of not a surgeon. We're kind of looking for a surgeon. Journalism. Uh, medical. The hospital could always use some caring sims who have the sharp logic mind, a steady hand, and willing to put in long, erratic, and often inconvenient hours. Be prepared because contributing to the wellness of other stats at the bottom of the pan bed. Yes, we need to get on the job. We need to get on the job ladder in the medical sector. Uh, so yeah, let's do it. We got you a job, my friend. I wish it was that easy to get people jobs nowadays. Look in the paper and click yes, but oh well. Look at him. He's got a happy face on. <laughs> That's his happy face, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Where's he going now? He's going to go somewhere else. I want to actually... Mark, What's so weird? What's so weird? What, is it? what does he need? How do we How do we find out? Example, Literally, I haven't played. Who's this guy? Yeah. Jeffrey Landgrab? Is this the guy that sold us a house? Uh, so he starts at 9am. He finishes at 3pm. And he starts in 23 hours. It's 22 simoleons an hour. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Right. I guess what we need to do... Okay, this is how we find out. He's got... He's pretty pretty full of hunger. What's, what's he doing? What's this? Entertained. Keep Boris <laughs> entertained. How do we do this? By mode. What does Sir Boris want? Not a clue. Um, what can we get here? Outdoors. What can we get him outdoors? Outdoor activities, a birthday inferno cake, a baseball, a foot and handball. What the hell's a foot and handball? You mean a football? Um, a jungle gym. A jungle gym for five hundred and fifty simoleons or a sky. <laughs> We're gonna get him a slide, guys. We're gonna spend all our money. We're going to put a slide in his house. He's going to be the most entertained, so fancy Boris Trotter in all of the land. Uh, let's go back into F1 mode and let's see what happens to this. Is Excuse me. There's a slide in your house. Just, can you... Does he not want it? Where's he going? What's he doing? What are you doing? What it? What are you... Oh, um... Okay, he's using the facilities. I don't want to see this. Can I, um... Can I... How do I get out of this? I don't want to see... So fancy about this having a whiz. Um, can we... You broke the toilet already? What are you doing? You've only just moved in. Has he broken it? Oh, I thought you broke the toilet then. He's going on the slide. Oh my god. He's going on the slide. Oh, there we go. This is it. This is the one. How's it? Can he climb up there? I'm not sure if he can climb up there. He's walking around. Walking around the nice brown couch. Yay! He likes it! He's running! What's it? I guess I can't have it indoors. Uh, let's go to buy mode. Let's pick this up. Can we have a water slide? Oh, can you imagine? I don't think we can. Let's go. Let's put it outside. Let's go back into live mode. 
So fancy Boris, can you can can we why can we not? Oh, here we go. He can't interact with a slide. You mean I've just paid all that money and he can't what's what's he what's he doing now? He's looking out of the window. What's he doing? So fancy Boris Trotter, you have a slide in your back garden, my friend. Why would you not even play with it? Is it for kids? Can I not get it? What? I don't, I don't understand this. What's happening here? Let's have a look. Um, outdoor activities. The wax bottom slide. I tell you what, we're going to sell this. Um, press delete. We sold it. We're going to go for the jungle gym. Can he do jungle gyms? Can he do... Okay, let's go for the swing. Hopefully, he should be able to go on the swing set. I hope. Swing! Look at this! This should keep him entertained for um, how many it is? Three hours or something like that. He's going outside. Sims love getting new things for their homes. I got him a new thing. Right, we've only got 400 bucks left, so hopefully he should be all right. Here he goes. Here he goes. So fancy body strutter. He's going to go on the swings. Woo-wee! Hiya! Watch this, like, about five hours later. I'll have to be falls off it. That'd be hilarious. Well, while he's doing that, I guess I could try and tart the house up a bit. We need to... <laughs> he's having the time of his life, this guy. Look at him. Wee! 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 Oh, my God, that is beautiful. Okay, so let's go back inside the house. Uh, I'm actually going to see what else we can do. I kind of need to design this a bit better. What is this? Is this a refrigerator outside of his house? I'm a bit worried, so fancy Boris Trotter. I think you're living kind of rough here, mate. Um, let's go. Walls up. It's, uh, there is a refrigerator outside of his house. What? What? I don't. I don't get it. What? Who designed this house? It's ridiculous. This is. We need to do some serious moving here. Right. So he has got at the moment. He hasn't got a lot. He's literally got. A cooker, a sink, it looks like a bathroom sink. He's got a fridge outside of his house. We're going to move this inside because that is ridiculous. Look at him, he's having the time of his life still on that swing. Uh, let's grab this. It's going to go inside the house because that was ridiculous. Why would we even have it outside of the house? I guess. Can we get like a TV? Oh, we should we? We're going to make him smart. We're going to try and get some books for him, I reckon. Let's try on. Uh, here we go, bookshelves. I'm really, I'm really just spending all this money on like the most ridiculous things you can ever think of in your life. Uh, a beautiful bookshelf. This is going to be our TV because we're going to get you smart. We're going to get you into the medical industry. Uh, here we go. Beautiful. Swing this around. I probably need to get used to these controls. This, this shouldn't be this hard. I swear this shouldn't be this hard. I've done this wrong. Can we turn the bookshelf around? There we go. There we go. Beautiful. We're also going to move this here. So he's literally just like sitting in front of the bookshelf. Um, okay, I guess we can fast forward time as well. Because he's going to be on there uh, for a while. He's very happy though. Look at him. He's having a blast. So fancy. So Boris is having such, such, so much fun. I can't even read. It's almost criminal. <gasps> right, speed it up. He's, sw he's swinging. <laughs> How can you swing that much? <laughs> he's been doing it for like nearly two hours now. This is crazy. Uh, his social is really good, and his fun is off the charts. His energy levels is getting low because he's been swinging for almost three hours now. He's, he's going all night long, this guy. Look at him go. So, Boris Trotter is on a roll. Hunger, we could do some food. Bladder is all right. Hygiene's all right. He has got work, I believe, in the morning. We're going to stop him from swinging at about... We're going to stop it now, actually. There we go. I'm sorry, mate. We're going to have to stop them. You can't go high. You've been swinging for about five hours now, you madman. Okay, so he needs some food. Let's go inside the refrigerator and try and cook him a meal. Have dinner. There we go. Mac and cheese arm salad. Let's have a mac and cheese. Go get a mac and cheese, sir, fancy. Uh, and then judging by his energy, he could do with going to bed soon. As well as using the, the little boy's room. So let's just put all these down. There we go. And then, I believe, he starts work in the morning. Where's his work? Um, I swear he's got... Has he got work in the morning? Here we go. Organ donor. He starts at 9 o'clock in the morning. That means that he's going to be going to bed soon. He's going to get up for a good day of work. We need, don't have a wardrobe, so we can't really uh, change his clothes to make him look more professional. 
But hopefully, he's going to go to work in an outstanding mood. He is sort of logic, but we've got the bookshelf, so what we can do is we can make him a bit more logical. Uh, I suppose he's earning skill points right now, just doing the cooking, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, so yeah, let's fast forward it. Let's get him making a meal. He's cooking away. Please don't set the house on fire, mate. Who's he, who's he, ca Whoa, who's he calling? Who are you calling? He's calling um, Jeffrey Langrab. He's a gene therapist. Whatever that means. Um, if there, I don't even have a clue. What are you doing? Eat your mac and cheese, mate. <laughs> Horror, <laughs> horrifying quality. His mac and cheese is. I don't think he wants to eat it. You need to eat it. Get off the phone and start eating, Mister um, Sir Fancy. Your hunger is very low. I don't care if it's really bad quality. Go and sit on your nice, lovely brown sofa, my friend, and eat. Come on, you need to get out of the bath. You need to stop messing about. It's 10 to, 10 to 8. Literally, you're going to be late for work. Don't be late on your first day. That's not good. Look at this house behind us. Whoa, what is that place? That's really cool. We need to go there. We need to... Oh, look. Carpool. Carpool. Get out of the bath. Out of the bath. Out of the thing. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. Quick. 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 Where's the carpool? Go to work. Go to work. Go. 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 Run. Run.